Steric hindrance is one of the top three answers in organic chemistry, at least in my classroom. And so being able to ask a why question in class and have them answer with some concept rather than having to put the top three answers uh, as multiple choice in the A, B, C format on the board all the time. Uh, I, I have taught my students those top three answers. So we're going to start with steric hindrance. Steric hindrance um, begins with the knowledge that in sign language, the atom is represented as the nucleus being my fist and the electron cloud being the area around, right, that area around the nucleus. So in steric hindrance, we're going to remove the nucleus and assume that this is the cloud of an atom. And then there's another cloud of an atom and they approach each other. So it's like, ooh, right? A lot of bumping into each other. The clouds are repelling. And so this effect is not good. And this also works with the universal uh, structure or drawing that we see in a lot of textbooks of these overlapping arcs. So steric hindrance.